Hey guys, welcome back to Just Fern Trudy. While you're here, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Today I'm gonna be doing a makeup tutorial on this look that you're seeing on the screen. Enjoy. It's kind of hard to do your brows on camera so i did my brows off camera and right now i'm just moisturizing my face using the tatcha water gel and the tatcha water cream now i'm just gonna use my favorite foundation this is dior backstage foundation in the shade 7.5 n and i'm just using my sponge to apply this foundation all over my face right now so I'm going to layer it a few times because I want that full coverage. Now I'm taking my ColourPop concealer and I'm just gonna clean up my brows on the bottom and the top and then I'm gonna blend it into my foundation. Now I'm just taking that same sponge that I used for my foundation and I'm blending in my concealer into my foundation with the sponge. And I just went ahead and took that head wrap off because I couldn't get close to my edges. I didn't want there to be a line. As you can see, it looks like there's a line right now, but all of that is gonna get blended and smoothed out. So now I just decided to go back in with more foundation. This foundation is really light, so you can really layer and layer and layer as many times as you want. And it's not gonna feel too thick. That's why I love this foundation. But I'm just going and trying to cover the line that was made from having the head wrap on. Now I'm just taking my concealer again and going under my eyes. I like under my eyes to be really bright. Um, so I'm just taking the same concealer that I use to go under my brow with and I'm just putting that to highlight in the areas that I want. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and blend that in with my foundation. Now I'm going in with my Fenty Pro Filter Powder and I'm gonna go set under my eyes and just put it in the areas that I highlighted. I found that I don't like baking with the Pro Filter Powder so I just go in like you see what I'm doing. I'm using my sponge and just tapping the powder into my skin. Now 
Now I'm just taking my darkest shade in my Fenty concealer to do a slight contour. Now I'm just gonna blend in that contour using my brush. Now that I'm done blending, I'm gonna move on to shadow. And I'm just taking the shade Mediterranean from the Anastasia Rivera palette and just putting it in the corners of my eyes. And I just wanted to pack on more, you know, because I'm extra. Then I decided to go in in my crease with the shade Palm from the same palette. Now I'm just gonna take some mascara as the base for when I put my lashes on, just so they look better and they blend well together. Next, I'm gonna be highlighting using Fenty Beauty. Now I just gotta decide what shade I wanna use. And I just love to pack on my highlighter, so I'm just gonna go in and in and in. And then I'm also adding some highlight under my brow bone. I'm going to apply my lashes off camera because it's just easier. But I just wanted to show you guys my lashes that i'm going to be using this is my third time using this lash and it's from my line o sugar lashes in the style cotton candy and now that both lashes are on i just have to spray some setting spray to complete this look And that pretty much completes the look for today, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. See you in the next video.